UC San Diego has roughly 38,000 students currently. We're one of the largest research institutions in North America. At UC San Diego, we've been using public cloud resources for quite a while. The initial work was a lot of small administrative stuff that we were doing. Uh, over the last two and a half, three years or so, that has kind of grown uh, significantly. And we've had an initiative to start moving things to public cloud. We have a cloud first, SaaS first model. And in the past year and a half, it's been somewhat of exponential growth in that arena. When we started to pay closer attention to what was going on within our public cloud use, we discovered we had you know, over a thousand accounts within Amazon at the time, and it was getting unmanageable because there was really no structure around how the use of the cloud was to be done. Monitoring costs, monitoring utilization, monitoring sizing, and so we've been spending the last year and a half, two years, really focusing on that and trying to optimize the use of public cloud for the university. We looked at a few tools. We knew about Nutanix and heard of Beam, and we were able to do a pilot and were able to fairly quickly get very actionable information for us to start to reduce our spend. And I would say that within the first 60 days, we probably took two to $3,000 a month out of what was our current run rate at AWS. And so the Beam tool has been very helpful for us in the visibility to see where things are and to give us actionable data and information and suggestions and recommendations to, to change our practices. And it's done quite a few things. It's both helped us on the financial side. It's also started to change some of the thinking of some of my technical folks that have been managing infrastructure for decades. Going forward, we are working with Nutanix to both make some augmentation and modifications to the Beam tool, which helps us immensely. And we are also looking at some of the other offerings uh, that are in the Nutanix suite, including their Calm product, and likely we'll be looking at their hyper-converged infrastructure as a replacement for some of our on-prem going forward, which will give me, which is what I've been looking for for quite a long time, the ability to look at both public and private cloud infrastructure in one environment and to be able to manage that for the future.